Hi my crafties, it's Tree. How are you doing today? I hope you're having a good and crafty day. I'm here for another video on the Pinkalicious Christmas collab. It's a swap giveaway. It's co-hosted by Marianne's Craft Corner and myself. We also have very talented crafters like Judith at Gigi's Cool Creations, Brenda at Brenda's Creations, Maria at Maria Reyes, Audrey at Fee or Faye Bricolis, Maria, or, I'm sorry, Gloria at Gloria's Crafts Halls and More, Betty at Scrap Passion 01, Sue at Crafty Sue 519, Kelly at Kelly Lynn's Crafts, Kim at Kim's Inspired Life. So, um, some very, very, very talented ladies. They will all be linked in the description box below, so be sure to go over and see their channels, see what they created, and follow their rules for signing up for their giveaway. <clears throat> For my giveaway, you just need to be a visible subscriber, 18 and older, and that you need to leave a comment on all my videos in this series. So, um, I'm not going to lie, I struggled. This week was embellishments and I overthought the whole thing. and. I finally decided that I wanted to work on those uh, fancy rosettes and I followed the tutorial from Amy L and I came up with this now I decided to cheat a little and <laughs> I just put the measurements in my brother's scanning kit and um, instead of doing every third tick mark or every third three-eighths of an inch I decided to go a quarter inch, which is a little too narrow. I also had my score lines extend too far to the edge, and I have a extremely, um, what are we going to call this, distressed look on this thing. So it is sort of cute, but it's not. And then I remembered Eve Era sent me these. Yay! Thank you, Eve. Now, don't get mad at me, guys. Um, every once in a while, when I really love your guys' uh, creations, I I might... <clears throat> confession time. I might um, pry them ever so gingerly apart to come up with a pattern of my own. <laughs> so, um, and then I put them back together again. So you cannot tell that this was pried apart and glued back together, can you? Except maybe I think I turned that one upside down. <laughs> so, um, anyway, I did that and I got my measurements and I came up with this. Not quite the same size, but I think it turned out pretty good. I like the the edge here where you can see that it does that where like this one sinks way in. So, um, all right. So I was using the Recollections um, paper pad sugar plums and I fussy cut out the tree and the cookie and I used my stickles in diamond and gold, gold on the stars, stickle, uh, diamond on the white and um, diamond dots in pink. I use some Nuo Drops uh, Strawberry Coolie for the stripes on that candy. And the crochet thread here. And yeah, I don't do well with, sorry, there is a, a thread there and I wanted to get rid of it. I didn't want it in the viewfinder, which it wasn't going to be the bit. Okay, we're moving on because otherwise I'm going to redo this video. All right, so that's that one. And then I created another one and I made it a little bit smaller um, by doing, uh, so I think that Eve's was one and a quarter and this one was one and a half. So I think this one is one or one and an eighth. And I just fussy cut out the ginger girl and I put a Daiso bow in her hair and I put this pink. I, I wish I knew where I got this pink. Someone gifted it to me. Uh, eyelash trim. I love it. And 
the Daisobo, some glossy accents on the face, and this is a heart that Eve Era sent me in some happy mail. So I just made this one a little bit smaller. <clears throat> and then the the pockets on my embellishment book, I used the top note, and so this is the cutout, and um, I used that, and the same thread there, crochet thread, I fussy cut out a cookie and glossy accent it and put, um, what's that stuff called? seed beads. They're clear to look like sugar. And um, I cut out a sentiment that says, oh so jolly. And the underneath, I wanted it to be gold. And I was being very lazy, which I, oops, sorry. But I also wanted something different. So I used some Bow Bunny gold texture paste and I kind of painted it on there. I, oops, losing a sea bead. I see some <clears throat> glue there. Excuse me. All right. And I also have, although you can't really see it, the pink heart trim there. And I'm going to put a, a dangle here, but I got to the point where I was like, I, I'm out of time. I need to get this done and um, uh, get the video up. So uh, more to come. And there'll be more surprises, I guess, for my recipient. Excuse me. Um, so the, there will hopefully be more embellishments, but we'll have to see how they fit in the book. And um, so this is all for my little share today. I hope you like it. Um, I will catch you in my next video. Please like, subscribe, and ring that bell. Leave a friendly comment below because it's how you get entered into the giveaway. And um, I said this already. I'll see you in my next video. God bless you and yours. Bye for now. <laughs>